Peace, peace, family. So I'm back with another one. Today what I wanted to do is I wanted to talk to my chosen ones about positive projection. Positive projection. Yes, I know we talk a lot about projecting and it's usually negative projecting first. But before we get into the negative projections, which we already have delved into multiple times, today I wanted to discuss positive projection. So what brought me to this subject today was I kind of had uh, heard another YouTube content creator had mentioned it and I had shared it on my Instagram story because I really enjoyed it when new information or, or something simple hits my spirit a certain way it just it's almost like that one dot that was missing that just kind of clarifies everything a lot more and I realized like when they said that, it, it automatically took me back into my past, right? To when I was younger, like, let's say 10, 11, 12, around those ages younger, you know what I'm saying? It take me back to those spaces in where I would be around certain types of beings, like friends or associates or things. And I would believe in them more than they would believe in themselves, whether we was all playing like toss up football or tag hide and seek like it didn't matter what it was i always had this perception of positive projection which i didn't know that's what it was i just assumed that other people thought and felt the same way i did and as I got older and started growing more and ascending and just taking more time into being more self-aware on a higher frequency, I realized, like, that has always been a space that I have occupied. And it became more evident the older I had gotten. So now with me being at this stage in my journey, it makes it very evident when I'm around people at this age now, you know, when I'm around certain types of beings and I believe in them the way I believe in myself, I am positive projecting. They don't feel the same way. They are actually projecting not as much of the negative but they aren't believing and projecting as much positivity as what I'm giving them right now so you have a lot of situations where somebody will be feeling shitty or crappy and they'll start projecting it outwardly but when they're projecting it they're projecting it as if you're the one that's feeling shitty or messy so positive projection would be the opposite of that I'm running into all these beings and I believe in them the way I believe in myself. I'm positively projecting something onto them. So when they don't accomplish it or when they cannot do it or when the obstacle is too hard or when they just don't want to, that's when I have to realize that I'm positively projecting what I would like onto them or how I see them. The thing is with me, I've always been able to dive deep into someone else's spiritual realm so i can see how far you're able to go so most beings when i come around them i can see their depths right away once i start being in a space i can see and feel their depths right away now whether they got blocked off from being able to access those other depths it's completely up to their journey you know but when i run into beings i'm able to process and access that so when it comes to the positive projecting, it's almost kind of like a healthier form of affirmations. Because I'm not really a firm believer in affirmations. Don't tell yourself you're beautiful and you're great and you're not. I don't give a damn if you're trying to get there or not. Don't do it to yourself. You have to be as honest and real as you possibly can be with yourself. So... We positively project outwardly all the time for us healthy chosen beings. 
not everybody because we already understand the bulk of the people is not riding or siding with us you know what i'm saying which is why we in the spaces we in now you know if it wasn't this way then it, it should be no reason why all of us are individually most of us are individually talking to the cameras with nobody in our space we should have people behind us in our space and we should have people on the other side of the, the camera as well too this should be as huge as the basketball celebrities the football celebrities the movie celebrities this should be more important because this isn't just entertainment this is knowledge and information and things that can be applied to your everyday life so for me i i i, I just i try to be aware at the highest degree possible when i'm out moving around and engaging and when I do find myself at that space to where I could be possibly negatively projecting, I usually try to word my words and point the finger at me when I'm in that energy so that way it doesn't accidentally get pointed out somewhere else where that person isn't engaging. You know what I'm saying? So, like, for instance, like, we all be around with you motherfuckers, but some situations we be turning up with witchy motherfuckers it just be on us so all we have to do is change our response and reaction time that's all we have to do because it's not gonna the, the witchy motherfuckers aren't gonna get subtracted out the equation yet they here we here and we all have to vibe and clearly we are the strongers out of the lessers you know what i'm saying the weakers the others whatever spiritual word you want to put on it you know what i'm saying but just understanding that we do positively project you know what i'm saying when i get up and i tell myself ah oh, man i gotta get this workout in and somebody's around me who don't work out that's a subtle way of positively projecting because i'm putting out some energy that i know that i've already been doing i haven't got it done today but i need to get to it and then the other person they don't do it so if they don't do it and then they're hearing me positively project this energy out it's slowly spilling over to them. It slowly spills over. So the thing is with positivity, quote unquote good, you know, you have to have the right energy behind it. Like a lot of people say things and, and, and like do things, but if it don't have the right energy behind it, it's not the same thing. That's why you can have a pie making contest and everybody makes a different kind of pie, even though it's similar. Let's say... We got 10 pie makers, and I need everybody to make sweet potato because that's my favorite, right? <laughs> but because they all are different individuals, most likely each pie will be a little bit different, even though the main base is sweet potato. You know what I'm saying? So the more we positively project, the easier it makes things around us and as far as dealing with and engaging with other beings and entities out here you know i'm like words are spells and spells are real so why not be aware to the highest degree as far as how you're communicating engaging and sending your energy out to other people and these are some things that we should just always take heed and keep in mind while we're out here operating in this 3D realm. So, we do positively project. You know what I'm saying? Even when you talking about your eating habits and things of that nature, that's positively projecting because now you done accidentally, or accidentally in the physical world, but intentionally in the spiritual world, because of what you're discussing, you done got your friends, your family, or somebody else, now they're eating grapes or watermelon. You know what I'm saying? So, that's not usually their thing, you know they normally eating candy bars and Snickers and shit, you know what I'm saying? So, just understanding that as long as we are doing this with the best intentions, you know, and we are curving the negative projection. And when you do have and you feel like you could be negative to negatively projecting, point the finger at yourself. So that way you aren't pointing the finger at others and blaming others for what's actually going on out here, you know? So that way you are making sure you are taking responsibility for your life and your actions. 
we point the finger outward when it's time to point the finger but when we're projecting something we want to make sure we're being accountable for the energy we're putting out that's of us and the energy that we could possibly be putting on to someone else you know what i'm saying and i don't like to accuse or misconstrue things when i can be a lot more clear about things you know what i mean so just keep these thoughts in mind you know what i'm saying we do positively project you know but it has to have the right energy on it, it doesn't matter somebody could say hey hey hope you have a good day but it doesn't mean anything and it's not going to have the same energy on it if everything starts within so i was about to come up with something else but everything starts within so you already know you're going to get your most fruits and your most filling from the sauce within you know what i'm saying but i ain't want to run it up too long you know what i'm saying tapping everything down below peace and love to the kings and queens mm -hmm.